What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. Alright, you know who this is, judging by the intro, right? So, we gotta get on and get this thing cracking. Well, let me, let me, uh... Let me say good morning, benvenue to all the people, all my foreign friends, all my local, national friends. Thank you for the support. And I want to talk about today is, what are you doing to help your situation besides bitching and moaning? Now, I want to know, like, I hear people, I see, like, I see all these protests starting to pop up. Like, North Carolina, they're starting to have protests about the voting rights laws now, all of a sudden. And I see other states are now front action in Michigan and this and that. And I want to know something. Where were you guys at when this was first starting? This didn't just happen. See, what it is is the liberal media lulls you guys to sleep. And while you guys, it, it reminds me of the game's over, and you're like, all right, coach, I'm ready to play. Well, the game's over. A lot of you sat on the sidelines, didn't want to do anything. Now you put on this fool paw attitude like, well, I support the people. No, you, you never support the people. You want to pretend you support the people. I mean, with all this stuff, this stuff didn't just, like I said, this stuff didn't just happen. It ain't like we just woke up and all of a sudden the Supreme Court voted on this. No, there's a process. And it was, it's been the Supreme Court for, what, at least a, a year. So, it's been, and if you look at my previous videos on, depending on what channel I, I upload this podcast to, if you look at my low rent channel, I was talking about this beforehand. I was talking about this a year ago, when nobody else was talking about this. Now, when, I, when, I, when it comes to fruition, and what I told you was going to happen, happen, now everybody's like, well, we got to get past that. No, you can't get past that. You know why? Because your seeds, the seeds of discontent, have started to bear now. Have started to, you know, blossom. And if you would have planted your seeds earlier about fighting these things that were getting stripped away, your rights are getting stripped away. We all, all a lot of us have been saying this. this isn't like I said, this just it, it didn't just happen overnight. But a lot of you guys were content because you were thinking, well, it doesn't affect me. When it affects you, you won't be banging, you won't be the first one in line banging the drum. Well, we need to do this, we need to do that. No, here's what it is. You just sit back and watch how we're doing it, and then help us. Because, like I said, a lot of you are just banging the drum just to bang the drum. A lot of you just blow a bunch of blowhards. I don't, I don't listen to like none of the stuff, half the stuff you guys say. Because, like I said, whenever I discuss this in my debate groups and my other groups, people are going to be like, I'm crazy. But it's, like I said, it's the seeds, you plant the seeds early for your fruit to bear and blossom later. And none of you guys want to plant the seeds to help out. Like, I was making videos, I was talking to people, I was talking to youngsters, I was talking, I was talking we had discussions everywhere. But a lot of you people were like, well, what have you done? Go on the front of my YouTube channel and look at one of my videos, I think the main video playing. It's at me at the radio station. I didn't get to the radio station just off of my good looks. There had to be, there has to be a, a little bit of a buzz generating about Mr. Warmack for me to get on that radio station. So if, if I generate a buzz to get on a radio station, apparently I'm doing something more than just sitting on my hands and typing. But a lot of you guys just think, oh, I'll just be a Facebook and YouTube activist. But that's not the point. The point is you got to actually get out there. You can still use Facebook and YouTube for your message. But you have to be out there with the people. And like I said, nobody that you, that knows me personally has made of it, and, and they trust me, they would have. Nobody that knows me personally has made videos against me. You want to know why? Because I have helped people. I mean, I mean, and people say, what have you done? Well, let me tell you what I've done. I'd help, I, I said this before in other words, I'd help guys who came out of the joint with bodies get jobs. No, I didn't have to do that, but I figured, you know, these brothers need a hand, and I knew who was hiring. You know, they linked up. And I, I, I helped. I didn't ask for nothing in return. I didn't, I didn't hold anything over their head. I just, you know, I helped them out. But all you people just want to be content and like it's, and don't like don't want to do anything till it affects you. Well, now I don't want to hear it anymore. If I start seeing it, and I want, I'm on this kick now where I want to see. Well, what, what did you do before? That's all the questions we'll start asking. What did you do before when it was going down? 
well, why do you wait till I'm asking these questions. You want to walk and put pressure on you guys finally. If you want to be held accountable, what's going to happen now? So, I'm tired of hearing all this crying whine about what well, we're voting rights are getting taken away. Whenever you sat on your hands and didn't do nothing when it first started. So, I'm out. Peace. <laughs>